this loose, you're gonna wanna just move your damper by hand. Zero it, all the way it can go. All right, so I'm gonna put this right at zero. So it's a power off to the actuator, so it's spring to zero. We're gonna line this up, it's now lined up. Now we can put this back in there. So, all right, now we have that at zero, this is zero, now you can tighten this up. This is the wiring diagram for the unit, but just some colorized. So you just want to line up all your colors. You have black on this brand is common. Red is 24 volts. White is your two to 10 in and orange is your two to 10 out. And they're all lined up orange, red to red, white to white, black to black, orange to orange. Usually you have a PL6 cable, but this one was extended. So now we're going to go ahead and run it through a test. So we're going to go to service. Unit tests, test mode needs to be on, which let's put one, 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 one. Let's hit it again. Service test, independent, economizer test. So we'll start with like uh, 50%, make sure it strokes. And if it's working, it looks like it is because you're already up to position one. And it's opening now. So we should get to be about position five for 50%. Okay, so it stopped right at 50%. So we'll go change it to like 90%. 95 actually I'll do. Yeah. Make sure it. 90%? Yeah, I go to 95 there. So it's continuing to move. It's moving pretty fast, actually. Some of them are really slow. That's a 70%. And yeah, those cogs move really slow. You put a piece of tape on there, you can see it. That's right now. This will be the best thing. Approaching 80%. Should be about 95. Mm -hmm. So you want to make sure it doesn't have any alerts or anything. I think you can leave test mode and go look at the inputs. Inputs. Analog inputs. Economizer position, it reached 92%. It can be within a percentage of that. So now we're going to go back down to the service. Bring that back down. In the configuration and settings, configuration. Going to go to economizer, vent method, economizer, max position. We're going to limit this to 95%. That way, in case there's a little bit of bind at the end of the stroke, it will not cause a nuisance trip. And then here, let's see, we have that piece of paper I had. Oh, here it is, the wind. Okay. We're gonna use this example. We're just gonna use the normal linear. Uh, we just need to set your damper position at max fan and then pick a slower speed and set your damper position there. So test and balance and normally do this, but we're just gonna set this example. So at the 100% fan percentage, Minimum position, 100% fan, max fan, they call it. We're going to set it for 35% or 23%. Yep. And then you're going to pick one of the speeds and leave the other one blank. Looks like there's a setting in each one in here. So somebody did try to set this one. Yeah. So... Yeah, so that tries to make like this non-linear and real complicated thing. So I wouldn't even do that. So what we'll do is we're going to pick at 30% speed like the example is. But you can use whatever they mm -hmm. they did their test at. So they're going to reduce test of balance. So say go to 30% fan and then they're going to open the position of the damper to achieve that same CFM they had at 100%. So this example had to go from 20. We had to go up to 35% to get that same CFM. So we're gonna, we'll just put 35%. And then these, 
we're just gonna leave them all at zeros to be unused. And that's it. So we just have two positions set. So, yep, 23% at max fan. So mm -hmm. when it's at 8,000 CFM and they program it to say for 500 CFM or whatever, they achieved it at 23%. Mm -hmm. Then they can slow their fan down to like 30% adjust their damper manually until they got that 500 CFM again. Oh, it took 35% damper. So they're going to go program that in mm -hmm. here. And then now it made these two plots for the 30% speed, mm -hmm. reduced damper at 100% speed, and anywhere in between, you know, it's basically going to extend the line automatically. It's just going to mm -hmm. make it a, a linear. Yeah. So that should work. All right. Let's see if I can do this off the cuff. This is a USB stick. So you got this set how you want it. USB connected, proceed with USB options, yes. Data acquisition, that's for when you want to trend, but we want to save your configurations to a file. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to go to File, Save Configurations. So it's doing it. It says idle. I got them all. Start. <laughs> These will get you to it. There you go. Yeah. Fifty percent successful. Okay. So press Enter. Go back. So do that and then uh, let's go to another unit go down to settings unit configuration economizer <laughs> so you see it just has like 30 and then it's all it doesn't have any settings Yeah, see how it's a zero. So I wanted to see that it had none before. So we're going to stick this one in here. That, let's see if we can find it. So it's prompting us because we had that. So now we're going to want to save configurations from file. Find file, yes. It might give a list. It's been a while. Uh, so we're not the JC unit. So we're probably this one right here. FC6737. Okay, so it looks like uh, the last four serial number, the last one. Pick that one. Come on. Enter. There we go. It's going to take a second. Yeah, probably a few more jets fly by. It says configuration restore complete. Let's pull that out. Maybe I should have pressed enter. <laughs> but now let's go back to those settings. Unit configs. Back down to the economizer. Minimums. Boom. So Dang. go get some sticks <laughs> just to get the basics. But you're going to want to set all your fan basic stuff first. Mm -hmm. All you maybe turn on if you added a fire channel, like I was talking about. You have to go through all those settings. Do all that on one unit. Then save the configuration. Then, then you just start with these configurations on every light unit. And then you fine tune it from there the Tessa Ballast Guy yeah. fan speed. So these are the default ones, just so then. Well, we programmed it in there, and you could make that be your default for starting with. Yeah. And so, like, right now, the unit would run off of that until the test of balance guy came. 